so guys, this is my outfit of the day. Earrings from, I actually don't remember. Top from the thrift store. Jeans from, I wanna say Forever 21. Um, I'm not sure what these jeans are from. And I got my little sandals. And yeah, outfit of the day. Okay guys, so I just left work. Now I'm about to go eat lunch. Hey guys, so as you saw, I forgot to record my lunch. I ate it too fast, I was too hungry. But anyways, I'm about to go to class in a few minutes. Uh, here's my friend Hope. Yeah, we're just sitting chilling. We're about to go to class in a few minutes, so I'll see you guys later. You look so beautiful. Yes. Hey. Okay, do that. That pose one more time. my vlog. Oh, hey, vlog. We out this piece. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. CJ. Naughty girl? Yeah. Naughty girl? Come on, more husband there. It's uh, me. It's not Naughty girl. Only me. Who else could it be? I'm trying to be in the episode. Well, you're in it. behind. Oh, this is the episode? Hey, guys. So, um, I'm directing the scene for my play darting class. And that's where I'm at right now. That's where I was at yesterday. So, stay tuned for my scene. I wrote this in the original piece. Hope you can hear me if you can't. It's okay. I'm going to, you know, play, um... <laughs> I'm gonna put captions down so you can't see. My makeup is like getting so like greasy. It's hot today, but anyways, bye guys. Basically, my V group is like small group that I have every Wednesday with a group of women from my church. Um, we call it V group because I go to Victory Church. So the V stands for Victory Church, ATL. So if you're from Atlanta, if you're in Atlanta, you're looking for a church home, Victory Church, ATL is a great church home. Um, and it's, uh, I want to say, 1190 Northwest Drive. Yes. Um, I'm going to leave the link to the church in our description box and the link to the youtube channel so you can check out uh, my pastor's sermons but yeah it's love fake group and it was really amazing um i love going there every time i go there i feel so um renewed in my spirit i feel so rejuvenated like i'm telling you guys i went there so drained and so tired because i've been at school since 9 a.m this morning as y'all saw and it's 11 o'clock and i'm just getting home and when i by the time I got to the beacon, it was about 9 o'clock, so I was really at school from 9 to 9. So, uh, yes. <laughs> so, yeah, I was very drained. But when I got there, they, it's just the word of God. I mean, that is what we live off of, you know? And, um, yeah, we live off of the word of God. And knowing that has just filled my spirit. Like, when I hear the word of God, it's like fuel to my bones. And... It just does like amazing things and so anyways i can go on and on about how good god is and how amazing jesus is and i just if you're watching this and you may not be christian you may not be religious you may not be spiritual whatever any of these things or you may be i don't know but i'm just here to say like jesus is amazing like Jesus is the best thing you will ever experience in your entire life of living. I'm telling you, like, I'm so serious. Jesus gives peace that the world cannot give. He said that in his word. And it's true because I've experienced that peace. That the world cannot give. No one can give it. I can give it myself. No one can give it. But Jesus Christ, you know? 
and like he gives us his joy he gives us his um just everything patience he gives us all this stuff you know and on top of that he saves us he saves our soul from our sins you know and so although we were brought to the world as sinners we are when you accept jesus as your savior you are no longer seen as that you are seen um you are seen with Christ's authority. Like we were talking about my big group, how the power of the blood of the blood of Jesus, you know? And when you accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior, and you plead that blood, that blood of Jesus plead over your life and over your body, that's how God sees you. He sees you with the mark of Jesus Christ, which is without blemish, which is righteous, which is holy. And on top of that, when you have the blood of Jesus on you, nothing, nothing, I repeat, nothing can harm you, nothing can stand against you. Um, so I just had to share that. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys have a great night. If it's nighttime, hope you have a great day. It's daytime, but your girl's about to go to bed, okay? I will see you guys in the morning. Peace out. Remember, Jesus loves you. <laughs>